Last year, we accomplished an incredible technical feat, launching an object into space on one of our flights and two hours later catching it in our bare hands as it parachuted uncontrolled back down over 60 miles away. Today, we're explaining how we accomplished this through a combination of preparation, skill, and a little bit of luck. Launching an object into space starts with modifying one of our launch vehicles to accommodate the item. We have a range of mounting setups for different sizes and shapes. And once the item is ready and the launch vehicle has been weighed, we can use that information to gauge which balloon size, parachute type, and volume of gas will give us the optimal flight path. In the week leading up to the launch day, we take wind data collected from across the world and run it through sophisticated climate simulation technology to predict the path our flight will take. We can control this to a certain extent by adjusting the ascent speed, the burst altitude, and the parachute we use to bring it back down to narrow down that landing site to within about 100 meters. We're aiming for an area that is far away from any built up areas, nice and remote, and away from major transport routes. Once the launch vehicle is in the air, our recovery vehicle hits the road. The onboard computer is relaying back its location in real time via radio, allowing us to update our simulations and refine the projected landing site. The unique geography of each square mile makes the last 100 meters or so the hardest part to predict. We're quite often underneath the payload as it's coming down and see a gust of wind take it right out of our hands. On this day, for the first time ever, all the elements aligned. Executing this kind of catch has always been an internal competition within our team. But if we were asked to replicate this for a commercial project, we have a bunch of ideas about how to make this happen reliably and predictably. So if you're that person and you want to see this happen, get in touch with us today. Otherwise, thanks for tuning in and check out our channel for loads more amazing videos captured at the edge of space.